Hello guys and welcome to Vlogmas week 2. So today is Sunday, December 6th. We're starting off week 2 of Vlogmas. I literally just showered. It's like 2 o'clock. I got, I got a very late start to the day. <laughs> Um, but I showered and now my hair is up. I have this one hair like pinned in the front because now that my hair is a little shorter, it doesn't all curl like this one perfect one does. But I'm about to do just some like simple makeup and um, I'm actually going to decorate the downstairs living room and my bedroom today for Christmas. Um, we couldn't get the stuff down from the attic just yet. Um, so we finally got it down this weekend and so I'm going to decorate that today. Um, that's probably all that's going to happen today, just some decorating and um, if you didn't see last week's vlog, must go watch that. It was really fun. I took you guys Christmas shopping with me and then I also vlogged for Candle Day, uh, part one and part two. <laughs> so um, that was really fun and yeah, I think I'm just going to do my makeup and then um, I'll see you guys later today. Okay guys, so I'm officially ready. It's like 4.30 p.m. I I slacked off a little bit uh, before I got ready, but I blow dried my hair. Um, I fixed, well, I kind of fixed the front piece. It's, I need to learn how to do uh, finger curls because this one looks okay. This one looks okay. And then I don't know what happened with this guy. So I still am figuring out, I, I just got a haircut like a few weeks ago and I'm still figuring out how to do this front part. She gave me like layered bang kind of almost. So. I don't, I don't know what's going on with it, but anyways, um, yeah, I'm gonna go downstairs and I'll probably make a cup of hot cocoa and start decorating, but, um, also, why do I talk like this? What has TikTok done to me? Why? I'm 23, I don't need to be doing this. Anyways, uh, beside the point, um, I'm actually gonna spray a little bit of some shine what is this? K-Pack Luster Lock Shine and Protect Spray on my curls so they're not so like frizzy. I actually really like that spray. I've, I've I kind of ignored it. I've had it in my collection for like two years and finally figured out that I like it. So I'm <laughs> gonna do that and let me show you guys my outfit. Don't look at my feet. Uh, I'm wearing just literally joggers, a t-shirt, and my pink hoodie kind of zip up whatever because I just didn't really want to wear real clothes today. <laughs> and I actually really need to um, clean my room and my bathroom upstairs because I haven't done that in a minute. So probably gonna do that today. Um, let me show you guys my scent of the day because I've been wanting to do that. I like keep forgetting, but Twisted Peppermint, scent of the day, making a lot of good progress. Um, I have this in my project, Use It Up, already making headway on it, so. We are looking good there, but I'm also watching Zoella's Vlogmas. I know she's kind of problematic, but really her Vlogmas videos make me so comfortable and cozy. So if you guys have other cozy uh, Vlogmas or vloggers that you follow, please leave them down below because I'd love to know like some more people besides just Zoella. And also, let me show you the candles I'm burning. I'm just all over the place today. Just wanna share with you guys. Okay, so we're gonna do it this way because I don't feel like turning the camera on. Pumpkin spice latte, because I'm trying to get the wax to be evenly pulled out and it won't do it. Um, and then chocolate grams. So it's like a coffee chocolate combo that I have going. I think it's really good, but I think I'm gonna blow these out soon um, and start a different candle downstairs while I do some decorating because I would like to have like a very Christmassy scent going while I decorate, so, and I'll probably put on a Christmas movie if my mom will let me because it's Sunday and there's football, so she might wanna watch football, so we'll just have to see. But yeah, it's uh, it's Sunday and I'm about to go decorate. Making my cocoa in my Ray Dunn cocoa mug. I don't like to fill it up all the way because this is like a lot. This is like 16 ounces in here. And using this cocoa from Walmart, this is the best brand I've ever found of hot cocoa. I love their cocoa. And then some peppermint crunch to go on top of the whipped cream. Literally watching Four Christmases with Vince Vaughn. And oh my 
my god, it's so funny. I forgot about how funny it was. Oh my god. Okay, it's currently 11 p.m. and I put up the Christmas tree. I watched uh, Four Christmases, I watched Christmas with the Cranks, we went and got Taco Gabbana for dinner and um, had a couple margaritas and some nachos and yeah, uh, I need to go to bed. I have an allergy test tomorrow to see if I have any food allergies. So wish me luck. I'll update you guys uh, if there's any results that soon. So hoping for the best. But uh, anyways, that is good night for me from day one of week two, December 6th. So see you guys later. Hello guys, it is Monday, December 7th. And I just got home from my food allergy test and I'm not allergic to any food. So thank goodness, so happy to hear that. So anyways, today I really need to run some errands. I need to drop some packages off at the post office. I need to um, pick up a few things from Walmart. I need to do my grocery shopping for the week. Um, I think that's everything. And I think there's a soap sale going on at Bath & Body Works, but I really don't need any soap. So hopefully I won't try and buy anything. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just gonna make me some like late lunch. It's like, uh, 12 o'clock maybe? Oh, it's not late then. I'm gonna make me some lunch. It's literally 12.06. Okay, I'm gonna make me some lunch and um, I scheduled my flu shot for three o'clock. So I'm gonna go get my flu shot at Walmart too. And um, yeah, I think that's everything. So today's just gonna be like running errands kind of day, like a typical Monday, you know? So gonna be really chill. It is Tuesday, December 8th, and I'm just having like a lazy start to the morning. My hair's not done. I don't have any makeup on, whatever. But I wanted to share with you guys, I just got in a delivery from Bath & Body Works from Candle Day. What? Um, so I ordered on Friday. This is four days that it took to ship, like including Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I ordered on Friday two candles and then two free body care items that I had coupons for. And so Vanilla Bean Marshmallow shipped separately by itself via FedEx and came from, Mon no, Missouri? Yeah, Missouri in four days to Texas from FedEx. And then also, so I like consistently check my Beth Body Works packages, like where they're at, and their usual shipping is through, what's it called? Uh, new logistics is their shipping that Bath and Body Works typically uses but this one was shipped with FedEx and with new logistics my stuff has either been coming from Atlanta Georgia or Grapevine Texas and either way it's been taking two plus weeks to get to me this took four days from FedEx and not only that is FedEx updated it almost twice a day updated the status of my delivery they updated it when it left when it arrived when it left different places, in transit, in transit. Like they updated at least twice a day, if not three times a day. Whereas Bath & Body Works typical shipping with new logistics updates me maybe once every five days uh, or maybe not even that, like longer than that. So last I checked December 2nd, my order from the 14th of November, um, on December 2nd, it finally got to Texas and they have not updated where it's at since it got to Texas. So, and it's currently the 8th, so that's six days they have not updated the location of my package. So I just have to say that their shipping sucks. And I think we all knew that. They just need to go back to, you know, typical shipping with FedEx and stuff. But anyways, let's talk about vanilla bean marshmallow while we're here. Um, this has, oh, it's like a, um, it's like a sentence. It's not just like notes. 
Vanilla Bean Marshmallow is a comforting vanilla fragrance that evokes the sweetness of a homemade marshmallow with essential oils. Um, I love the packaging on it. It's like a peachy light pink um, with a little moon on it, but it's a very light smell, you can tell. But it definitely has the same marshmallow scent as um, peppermint marshmallow. I was just burning that single wick last night. And yeah, it definitely has that same marshmallow mix kind of with the vanilla bean noel vanilla fragrance so it's almost like a frosting vanilla but that's really really good it's probably going to be a medium to light thrower just because the usually the vanilla scents the straight vanilla scents are very light but i don't mind that i really like that so yeah my candle day order came in before something that i ordered on november 14th so get your shipping in check bath and body works because it's disappointing but anyways, um, today I think I'm going to edit a lot of videos, I'm going to record some videos, and I'm probably not going to do much interesting stuff. So, another boring day. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I think that's, that's everything for now. I might see you guys later today. We'll just have to see. So, until then. Good morning, guys. It is Thursday, December 10th. I did not vlog yesterday. It, um, I'm just drinking my coffee this morning and it doesn't taste that great. I used my pumpkin, um, um, skinny syrup instead of my peppermint ones, so I don't like it as much. But anyways, yesterday was, I just didn't vlog. I was very, very, very busy with work and just did not have time and I didn't do anything interesting, so I did not vlog it. But um, today is another very busy day at work. Probably not gonna do anything interesting today either. But um, I know this weekend is the body care day sale for $5.95. And I do plan on hauling some stuff from that. So you will be seeing um, some vlog footage hopefully from Saturday for the sale. But I, I'm literally not doing anything interesting today. So, still waiting on Bath and Body Works packages. Um, so, I guess I'll update you guys if those come or not. But today is just going to be another very busy day at work. And I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. Hello guys, it's a Friday, December 11th, and I'm in the Panera drive-thru. Well, not really in the drive-thru, I'm waiting for my meal. They must be like so super busy, and she might be coming out with my food right now. So I'll be back. I don't want to be embarrassed. <laughs> it wasn't my food. <laughs> I don't know how long it takes to make a turkey bacon avocado sandwich, but I don't, I don't want to be mean. But anyways, I'm picking up Panera. It's a very 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 busy week so crazy at work and um i really don't want to get up at 6 a.m for body care day tomorrow but i do want coconut mint drop and i know that's gonna be like one of the first things to go and my stores have only ever had like such a tiny amount of those of the coconut mint drop fragrance in different forms we've only ever had like like three on the shelves at a time so i know i'm gonna have to get there early if i want it and also if I want the body butters. And people are like yelling. Like one guy has got out of his car and went into the store. I don't know why it's taking so long. There's like five people waiting for their orders up here. This man just zoomed out. And I couldn't tell if the, he probably wasn't. I couldn't tell if the cashier who, who was like cashing me out was flirting with me or not. Cause he was like making conversation, but he probably wasn't because they were just like running late on orders. So he's trying to like talk to me for as long as he could before. He had to tell me to go park, thinking they would make the order, but they still haven't, and it's been like, I think I got here at 6.20, it's 6.56. Oh my god, that's a long time. I probably parked at 6.30, but that's 26 minutes, and I didn't get my receipt, because I'm stupid, and I was like, I don't need a receipt, save the trees. So, I can see him running around back there. Well... Anyways, let's see if one day I'll get my sandwich. 
I have to actually be back at work. I'm not supposed to leave for this long. I'm literally supposed to have a 30 minute dinner break. So, anyways, I'll update you guys once I get my food. Okay, so I'm back from Panera. Um, and they felt so bad that it took so long to get my order that they gave me some extra stuff. So I'm gonna show you the extras that they gave me. Cause like the guy who took my order was super sweet and he was like, I'm so sorry. So he gave me some extras. I think that's an oatmeal raisin cookie, which I'll take home cause I do really like raisins. Some potato chips. This is what I got. The turkey bacon avocado BLT and an extra cinnamon roll, which I, this one's for me, and I gave the other one to my coworker before he left today. So I'm about to dig in and yeah, probably put on a show on Netflix. Let me know down below what you guys are watching right now. I'm not sure, I just finished The Crown, so I don't know what I wanna watch next, but let me know down below. Good morning guys, it's 6 a.m. I'm actually a little bit late and they made us go through the security doors. So I hope I'm going to the right spot. Um, I'm at the mall. I said 6D. This is the only place, oh, 6D. Yeah, okay. There's a little sign in the parking lot. So uh, I hope this is right. Substation. I don't know. I'm a little confused, but this is the only spot in the entire parking lot at the mall that has people. It's not, it's not that many though. It's less than 20 cars, so I might even still be in the same, the first batch of people. When I called yesterday, they said they were only letting 47 people in. So, okay, it's probably over here. no one in the store. I'm so surprised. It was me and one lady and her kid and then one gentleman walked in and walked out. I don't know if he bought anything but wow. There was nobody there. <laughs> I 
found Santa's tree. <laughs> Some thumbnail. I cannot, don't mind me, I have my, my headband that has the buttons on it so I can put my mask on there. But I, I cannot believe how amazing that experience was. And it's only 6.30 and uh, I got everything that I wanted. So that was great. I think I'm just gonna stay up to be honest. I'm already awake now. So yeah, might go shower and actually get ready and then film the whole video that'll be up probably before this so if you haven't seen that then go look at that but yeah it's still dark outside so yay <laughs> Hey guys, I'm back home and I showered and I got ready, but I just wanted to show you what I got from Body Care Day. I do have a video up. It was posted yesterday, so if you're gonna go check it out, I'll try and link it up above if I remember. But yeah, this is everything that I got. I took a nap and I woke up to, my mom got Taco Cabana quesadillas and Margarita's Forest and uh, LSU is playing Florida right now. So, game night. Boy, I look like a wreck. Um, it's 10.45. The Tigers beat Florida, which is very surprising because Florida is ranked number sixth, or they were. They're about to probably drop. They were ranked number six, and LSU was unranked. So if you know football, that just means like we suck. <laughs> LSU sucks, but we still beat Florida. So not sure how that happened, but it was a really great game, and I screamed a lot, and now my throat hurts. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm going to take all my makeup off and um, head to bed. But that is it for week two of Vlogmas. I hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog this week. It is a longer vlog. Um, don't look at my messy closet. Oh my gosh. Um, it was a longer vlog just because I was like super chatty this week. So I hope that's okay. I hope you guys still enjoyed it a lot. Um, comment, subscribe, like. Uh, that all helps out my channel a lot. You guys, it actually really does. I got a end of the year report from YouTube. I'll probably share it with you guys in the next um, vlog just because I don't have my laptop out right now, but I'll share it with you guys in the next vlog. But it's like really interesting to see all the statistics of how my channel has grown this year. So thank you guys so much. If you're a new subscriber or if you've been with me for a long time and you continue to watch, thank you so much. It means the world to me. But I'm gonna go to bed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.